Okay, talking about getting into the taper in this episode. Here we go. Okay, as I mentioned in the last episode, um, getting into the taper is something that is new for me. If you're new to this channel and you're watching this for the first time, my name is Brian. I'm getting ready for running my first marathon. This one's going to be by myself and uh, I'm experiencing what it's like to go through the taper. Now, I will say um, the plan is pretty good. You know, stay hydrated, work on some stretching, stay healthy, uh, use the taper as a time to repair and restore the muscle groups. Uh, and, and the way that I did that was to drop uh, the volume. It feels weird to drop the volume out the way that I did, uh, going from 40 mile weeks um, and hitting peaks such as 50 mile weeks. And now all of a sudden you're looking at, uh, in my case, dropping it down to around 25 to 30, which is fine. So tonight is one of those nights where I'm gonna get out there, um, take a slow aerobic zone two run, and uh, I'll be right back. Here we go. Uh, the wind is such a great teacher. I feel like you're going nowhere. It's so challenging. But I guess it's all worth it, eh? There's that. Uh, yeah, that run was cold. And uh, it's funny because here, around here, we ended up getting snow for two days, yesterday and this morning, <clears throat> and uh, light snow. But the winds are dramatic right now. I have to step in here, uh, and I forgot how much of a teacher that wind is. And I remember episodes long ago, or that feel like long ago, where I was saying I got to tuck away these mental receipts as lessons uh, that there are going to be hard days, there are going to be hard moments, there are going to be things that I want to quit on. And um, yeah, the wind can kind of reinforce that for you. You know, it's really tough to run against, but you ultimately have to go through it in order to continue on and perhaps have the wind at your back at some point. Um, so that was sort of my mindset there on that run. Um, as far as the taper goes, you know, we're sitting at like 20 miles um, right now uh, for the week. I'm sorry, 15 miles for the week. Another 10 tomorrow, six on Sunday or five or six on Sunday should round out my 30 for the week. Um, and that'll be that. And then, you know, a slow taper and reducing some of the volume because the work is in. It, this is as good as it gets uh, as far as this taper goes. I would love to hear your thoughts on... Um, how you taper. So if you have suggestions or feedback, please leave them in the comments. If you know me and you are here watching this, please subscribe, uh, give me some feedback, let me know your thoughts. And then the other thing is I have new shoes coming tomorrow and I will talk about that on tomorrow's run. I'll put the run details here. As always, thanks for watching, I appreciate your time.